Maybe he should have shown a woman a little respect. It has been a massive year for Laura Dern, and honestly, we're not mad about it. Amazing. The Oscar-nominated actress has not only dominated the big screen, but the small screen, as Renata Klein on HBO's Big Little Lies. And in season two, well, she delivered this iconic line. I will not, not be rich. This launched one of the internet's most popular memes. I will not I will. not be rich with my favorite oh, yeah. meme of 2019. <laughs> Do you love how you've been memed as that character? I I mean, she requires it, yes. and I love her so much. So I'm thrilled for her that she's a meme because she would really appreciate it, and I could never say no to Renata. Another role she couldn't say no to this year was her portrayal of Marmee March in the movie Little Women, which earned six Academy Award nominations, including Best Picture. And it also gave us one of the most surprising BFF duos, Laura and Timothy Chalamet. Man, I'm sitting next to such an incredible actress and an incredible oh human God. and someone that and I could say because I worked with her. This is an incredible person. So to Aww. have not one but two roles that are exemplifying that this year, or not even her personhood, her in touchness with the human condition, let's say. It's awesome. The two BFFs also attempted to troll us with the identity of Baby Yoda, who Dern suddenly told Variety could be someone familiar. Have you seen Baby Yoda? Yes, I did. What do you think about Baby Yoda? Since today. I saw. I don't know if it's a him or a he or she. I don't know, but I think he was at a basketball game. Of course, the internet went off when they realized who she was at a recent basketball game with. Crazy. <laughs> and although we don't know if Timothy is actually Baby Yoda, what we do know is that Laura Dern is coming for that Oscar. The actress is nominated for Best Supporting Actress for the Netflix film Marriage Story. People don't accept mothers who drink too much wine and yell at their child and call him an I get it. I do it too. But the Oscars won't be the last we see of Dern. She's set to reprise her role in Jurassic World 3 coming to theaters in 2021. I'm in bliss. I mean, it's just, um, you know, it's what you dream of your whole life to get to work with people you love so deeply. I will not be making Laura Dern pick her favorite award season movie between her two movies on ET, but I'll tell you later what mine is. Okay, bye. <laughs> Marriage women. <laughs>